be sharing some information on interprofessional collaboration in enteral nutrition delivery. I'm Beth Quachara, a clinical nurse specialist speaking on behalf of the Academy of Medical Surgical Nurses. And my colleague is Ainsley Malone, a clinical practice specialist from the American Society for Parenteral and Enteral Nutrition. The nurse dietitian partnership in enteral nutrition is critical. The dietitian, as you know, is, is an essential colleague. And this partnership optimizes enteral nutrition delivery and complication prevention. Communication is key to capitalizing on this partnership. First, I want to go over the Aspen Nutrition Care Pathway and who does what in this process. During the admission screening, the nurse usually completes the form. Nutrition screening information, such as if the patient has had weight loss and what diet they are on is collected. This data helps determine if malnutrition is suspected. If it is, usually the dietitian will be notified through an automatic trigger or a consult. Thanks, Beth. This is Ainsley Malone. If malnutrition is suspected from the screening results, the dietitian will complete a full nutrition assessment and using various tools will identify if the patient is malnourished or not. Once malnutrition is identified and documented by the dietitian, the provider will also document the malnutrition diagnosis. Then a care plan is developed and implemented by the whole team, including the dietitian, the nurse, the pharmacist, and the provider. In the case of enteral nutrition, the feeding tube will be placed and the plan will be started. The dietitian will recommend the best feeding formula and rate to get started and how to advance. Each team member will monitor the tolerance of the enteral nutrition and evaluate if improvement is happening. The nurse should communicate the amount of formula the patient has received, as well as their weight and any gastrointestinal complications. The partnership between the nurse and the dietitian is truly collaborative. To review, these two professionals work very closely together in all steps of the nutrition pathway. More specifically, the dietitian will share nutri nutrition screening and assessment findings and create a plan of care to include enteral nutrition delivery. Together, they begin the plan with tube placement, formula selection, and the initiation and advancement of the enteral nutrition. The nurse will communicate tolerance to the enteral nutrition, their intake, and nutrition parameters such as weight. Together, they will discuss complication prevention with various treatment options. And if the patient will be discharged with enteral nutrition, they will plan the discharge or the transfer of care program. Here are some additional resources to augment what has been learned today. I'd like to thank you for your participation. This program was supported by Abbott.